Extraction of iron. Extraction of iron. This one we did it in candy. We don't Candy versus seminar. We changes in matter seminar also we did. Extraction of iron. Right. Special points. Listen, man. What is the setup you need for extraction of iron? You need a blast furnace. What's the setup you need? Blast furnace. What's the setup you need? Blast furnace. What's the setup you need? Blast furnace. So the setup you need for iron extraction is blast furnace. What's the setup? Blast furnace. Second. What is the temperature range in a blast furnace? In a blast furnace, temperature range is from 1900 degrees Celsius at bottom to 1000 degrees Celsius at top. So the temperature range in a blast furnace is 1900 degrees Celsius to 1000 degrees Celsius. 1900 degrees Celsius to 1000 degrees Celsius. 1900 degrees Celsius to 1000 degrees Celsius. What you blew from the bottom? What you blew from the bottom? Hot air is blown from the bottom. What is blown from the bottom? Hot air is blown from the bottom. What is blown from the bottom? Hot air is blown from the bottom. Again, what is the setup you use for iron extraction? Blast furnace. What's the temperature range? 1000 degrees Celsius to 1900 degrees Celsius. What you blow from the bottom? Hot air is blown from the bottom. Next. What are the raw materials you insert? Raw materials means what are the things you insert inside for the extraction of iron? Three raw materials are there. One hematite, one hematite, two coke. Coke means coca cola. No, 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 coca cola. Carbon is coke. Carbon is coke. Hematite is what? Fe2O3. Hematite is what? Fe2O3. Coke is carbon. And then limestone is inserted. Limestone is inserted. Better to crack. Crush the limestones and insert it. Not as big, big stone. Crush it and insert it. What is limestone? Calcium carbonate. What is limestone? Calcium carbonate. Again, what are the three raw materials? Hematite, Fe2O3, coke, carbon, limestone, calcium carbonate. What are three raw materials? Hematite, Fe2O3, coke, carbon, limestone, cal calcium carbonate. See, CO3. Again, what is the setup you use for extraction of iron? Blast furnace. What are the what is the temperature range in a blast furnace? 1000 degrees Celsius to 1900 degrees Celsius. What is blown from the bottom? Hot air. What are the raw materials sent from top? Hematite, Fe2O3, coke, carbon, limestone, calcium, carbonate. Right. What type of a reaction is extraction of iron? What type of a reaction is extraction of iron? Remember, extraction of iron is a Reduction reaction. What type of a reaction is extraction of iron? Reduction reaction. What type of reaction? Reduction reaction. Okay. Up to there, only you are going to memorize. From here onwards, logically, we are going to write down the chemical reactions happening in extraction of iron. Up to there, only memorizing. Huh? After this, logically, we are going to write down the chemical reactions. Now, listen. Now listen, Lamai, what we are doing? We are extracting iron from what? From hematite. Hematite is Fe2O3. From hematite, we need to get down iron. From hematite, Fe2O3, we need to extract iron. From hematite, we need to extract iron. To extract iron, can you see? The only thing you need to do is remove oxygen. If you can remove all the oxygen, iron is going to remain. If you can remove all the oxygen, iron will be remaining. So what we need to do here is, your aim here is removing oxygen from hematite. What is your aim here? Removing oxygen from hematite. That is your aim. Now keep that in mind. First. Number two. I wanted to introduce you all a serial killer. Who is the serial killer? Carbon monoxide. What a period there. 
carbon monoxide mara ya absurd absurd pura always ya mara psycho mara psycho fellow is this carbon monoxide carbon monoxide co is carbon monoxide mono means what na be mono means what mono kiyan what is mono what is mono mono means what mono means one carbon monoxide carbon mono oxide i will separate it and write carbon mono oxide carbon mono oxide one oxygen one carbon one oxygen carbon mono oxide carbon dioxide means la bhai di means what di means what di means what di means to carbon dioxide co2 carbon mono oxide co carbon dioxide co2 so here we are talking about carbon monoxide one carbon one oxygen co is a formula now la bhai carbon monoxide maarani absurd pura ka this fellow is a psycho this fellow is a psycho actually on to what it is psycho it can see someone joining with oxygen in oxygen and remaining in peace what it needs to do is if it sees someone remaining with oxygen it will quickly go there remove all the oxygen and get it to itself that is the dangerous thing about carbon monoxide so carbon monoxide and oxygen you can't keep them close why suddenly carbon monoxide will go remove the oxygen and attach it to itself such a pirate this fellow is pirate on oxygen this fellow on mara pirate kama kiyen oxygen le pirate oxygen on mara pirate on irukudu it can see someone remaining with oxygen if it see someone is with oxygen it will remove the oxygen and attach it to itself that is carbon monoxide we have hematite fe2o3 and we know now carbon monoxide's main job is removing oxygen Now what we need to do? Hematite is there. In hematite, you have oxygen. What you wanted to do is remove oxygen from hematite. That is what we wanted. What we wanted is remove oxygen from hematite. And what we know is carbon monoxide is a psycho. It can remove the oxygen from someone. Then now can you see what is our job going to be? Mara simple. Our job is somewhat, somehow making these two people meet. If you can make these two people meet, carbon monoxide will remove all the oxygen. Hematite will be removed. Hematite will be remaining. Uh, sorry, iron will be remaining. <laughs> carbon monoxide will be reacting with hematite. Iron will be remaining. So our main job is making these two people meet. If we can do that, we can extract the iron from them. Iron from them, you can extract. If you can meet, make these two people meet. Ah, let's make them meet. Now, what are the things we have? We have directly hematite as the raw material. Hematite is there directly as the raw material. Do we have carbon monoxide as the raw material there? No. Then your first job is producing carbon monoxide. What is your first job? Producing carbon monoxide. What is your second job? Making those two people meet. That's it. Then what are your two jobs in a blast furnace? Producing carbon monoxide. One, making carbon monoxide meet with hematite. What are your two jobs? Producing carbon monoxide, making carbon monoxide meet with hematite. Ah, now we'll do it. We'll do the first job first. Your first job is producing carbon monoxide. You wanted to produce carbon monoxide. How to produce carbon monoxide? Two stages are there. Two steps are there. Number one, you have coke. Coke reacted with oxygen. When coke reacted with oxygen, carbon monoxide, maybe carbon dioxide will be formed. When coke react with oxygen, carbon dioxide. Form. Carbon with oxygen, carbon dioxide. Carbon with oxygen, carbon dioxide. Again, carbon with oxygen, carbon dioxide. We don't need carbon dioxide. What we need? Carbon monoxide. how to do it again react the carbon dioxide with furthermore carbon 
when you react carbon dioxide with furthermore carbon dioxide our required product is there so two steps to produce carbon monoxide now it's are memorized carbon with oxygen carbon dioxide carbon dioxide with carbon carbon monoxide again carbon with oxygen carbon dioxide carbon dioxide with carbon carbon monoxide our psycho killer is ready now next what is our job third is the most special or important job what is the third job our serial killer is there carbon monoxide is there making that fellow meet with fe2o3 that's it what did i tell this fellow is a pereta this fellow will remove all the oxygen when this fellow removes all the oxygen what is remaining fe there you go this fellow removes all the oxygen iron is remaining to extract the iron job done now what will happen this fellow removed all the oxygen monoxide now becomes dioxide monoxide now becomes dioxide monoxide became dioxide that's it iron extract that's it iron extract where is the equation arave 1323 balancing no take away na 1323 balancing 13 no? 23 that's the balancing no? check and see Balancing. Yes. Can remember? Can the people remade a balancing technique for this? Thirteen twenty three. Thirteen twenty three balancing. Thirteen twenty three balancing is for this. So here one. No need to put it. Three, two, three. Thirteen twenty three. Thirteen twenty three is the balance. Thirteen twenty three is the balancing. That's it. The job is done. Okay. Now understood iron extraction are the dangerous part. How does the section get easy? Understood. This is the hardest part. Iron extraction get easy. Two more steps now. Two more steps. Not done. Day, 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 day. Iron is extracted. Then you will tell me that probably is done. No, my this iron has so much of impurities in it. Impurities can are sand is there, aluminium oxide is there, like that. Some impurities are there. So after removing or extracting iron, still impurities are also there. So your final step is you need to remove the impurities. That is your final step. That we can study separately. Now iron is extracted. Your job is done. But the problem is extracted iron is mixed with impurity. So your final step is removing impurities. Final step is removing impurities. For that also three reactions are there. What are the three reactions? Lamai to remove the impurities, you need calcium oxide. To remove impurities, what you need? Calcium oxide. To remove impurities, what you need? Calcium oxide. To remove impurities, what you need? Calcium oxide. You all tell me. In the raw materials, do we have calcium oxide? In raw materials, do we have calcium oxide? No, but what we have there, calcium carbonate is there. We don't have calcium oxide. Calcium carbonate is there. Huh. Now, using calcium carbonate, try to make calcium oxide first. Using calcium carbonate, try to make calcium oxide. How to make? Today we discuss this reaction. Making calcium oxide using calcium carbonate. Very simple. When calcium carbonate decomposes. Calcium oxide, carbon dioxide. When calcium carbonate decomposes, calcium oxide, carbon dioxide. When calcium carbonate decomposes, calcium oxide, carbon dioxide. In balance, it has one calcium, one calcium, one carbon, one carbon, three oxygen, two plus one, three oxygen. Equation already balanced. Now what? Removing impurities. No. To remove impurities, you need calcium oxide. That you got. Your impurities are going to be silicon dioxide (SiO2). And is what is silicon dioxide? Sand. Sand is silicon dioxide. So hematite will be mixed with sand. You need to remove that sand. Plus aluminium Al2O3, aluminium oxide. Al2O3. These are your impurities. Al2O3, SiO2. Al2O3, SiO2. Again, what are the two impurities in iron in hematite? SiO2, Al2O3. What are two impurities? 
SiO2 Al2O3. What are the two impurities? SiO2 Al2O3. Using what you remove them? Calcium oxide. Using what you remove them? Calcium oxide. And yes, sir, when they react, what is going to be formed? It's a very long one to write to now. Those who can remember, they know what a very long one. They remember, there's a shortcut for this. Huh? Now, here the answer that you are going to get is a long one. But there's a shortcut to write that reaction. Very simple. Add everything and put together. Starting from calcium. One calcium, write down calcium. One silicon, write down silicon. All together, how many oxygen? 2 plus 1, 3 oxygen, no? O3. Calcium silicate. Ca. Everything at then right. Starting from calcium. Calcium, silicon, 3 oxygen. Calcium silicate. Here also same. Add everything and right. Starting from calcium. 1 calcium, calcium. 2 aluminium, Al2. 3 plus 1, 4 oxygen, O4. A, C, A, A, L, 2, O4. Nothing to memorize. So these two reactions don't memorize. Now you want to memorize. Those two reactions don't go to memorize. There's nothing to memorize here. That's what I told you. Logically, you can write. Again, from the beginning, ion extraction. What is your job in doing ion extraction? Making hematite meet with carbon monoxide. Making hematite to meet with carbon monoxide. Carbon monoxide you don't have. So your first job is producing carbon monoxide. Carbon plus oxygen, carbon di dioxide. Carbon dioxide plus furthermore carbon, carbon monoxide. Carbon monoxide produced. Carbon monoxide with hematite. All the oxygen removed, iron is remaining. That removed oxygen joins with oxygen, uh, joins with carbon monoxide. Now you have carbon dioxide. How to balance 13, 23? That's it. Iron is extracted. Is this iron pure? No, impure. What are the impurities present? Silicon dioxide, SiO2, Al2O3. How to remove them? Using calcium oxide. Then your next step is producing calcium oxide. How to produce calcium oxide? Decomposition of calcium carbonate. Calcium carbonate decomposed to produce calcium oxide plus carbon dioxide. You have calcium oxide. When these two reacts, add it and write. Add it and write. So, this two mixture, you give a special name. This is called as slag. What is it called as? Slag. What is it called as? Slag. Remember, slag is going to float on iron. Slag will be floating on iron. Slag is floating on iron. You can easily remove the slag. Under that, you have PO iron. That will go. PO iron extracted now. Job. Understood now. Logically understood. Logically understood. Or, me me memorizing the I want you to understand it logically. Okay. Okay. No? There's a question. What is reduction means? You will learn deeper about reduction under electrochemistry. But simplify tell. Reduction means removing oxygen. Oxidation means adding oxygen. Reduction means removing oxygen. This is the simple definition I can give for now. Later on electrochemistry, you will be talking deeper about it. Removing oxygen, reduction, giving oxygen oxidation. See, carbon monoxide is removing oxygen. Reduction reaction. Carbon monoxide removing the oxygen reduction reaction. Okay. That's it. Iron extraction also done.